Hello, my 3D printer peeps. Hello, Bamboo Lab users. Have you ever worked with a cute little model that has a smooth surface, such as this man? Manatee that has smooth skin, but would look really cute if it had fuzzy skin. Do you ever wish you could just put that fuzzy skin in certain places rather than the entire model? Have you ever worked with a model that has a moving functional part such as this T-Rex, where this neck snaps onto a ball joint and moves up, down, and all around? Have you ever wished that you could add texture to a specific part on that joint so that the neck or head stays exactly where you put it without drooping? Well, thanks to Bamboo Lab 2.2, now you can, using the Fuzzy Skin Painting Tool. I'll show you how to do it right now. Here I am in Bamboo Studio 2.2 Beta. Depending on when you watch this video, you might be on a different version. If you are on at least 2.2 Beta or beyond, you will have the Fuzzy Skin option. That Fuzzy Skin tool is right here, represented by this box and the wiggly lines. Or you may simply press the H key. Be sure to have your model selected first, then press the H key. Applying fuzzy skin is quite easy. However, there are many tools to work with to customize it to meet your needs. For this demonstration, I'm going to show the basic use of this tool. Here, I'm looking at a manatee. Let's say I want to add fuzzy skin to the head. In other words, I want to add a texture to the manatee's head. I've entered the fuzzy skin tool and I have the option of these four tools just the same as if I were painting. For the head, I will use the Fill tool. To do this, simply click on Fill, then click on the model. You will see the head has turned purple. This represents the area of the model where fuzzy skin has been applied. You will see the bottom of the model where it contacts the print bed has automatically been excluded. Just like the Paint tool, if the Fill tool for fuzzy skin does not fill the entire part you're looking for, simply adjust the smart fill angle until it does. Let's go ahead and add fuzzy skin to the tail and the face. We have now created a model where fuzzy skin will be applied to the face and tail of this manatee. However, there are other uses for fuzzy skin, such as adding friction to a movable assembly. Let's look at two examples from Original Toys 3D. Here is the neck and connector for this T-Rex model. The ball of this connector pops into the socket of this neck joint. This allows movement of the head and neck. However, you might want greater friction so that it stays put better or requires a little more effort to move the head. And then of course, allowing the head and neck to stay in the position you leave it without any sagging or drooping. Fuzzy skin is a great way to do this. You may simply click on this model, enter the fuzzy skin tool, and add fuzzy skin to these ball joints. When printing, you will now have a rough surface on these joints, which will add friction to the socket and hopefully allow this neck and joint to have a stiffer movement. Of course, you could also add that fuzzy skin to the inside of this socket using the fill tool. Now we've got fuzzy skin on the socket and the joint. One thing you'll notice is that there is no indication that fuzzy skin is present unless you enter the tool or you slice the model. Let's do that now. Upon slicing the model, you can see the fuzzy skin has been applied to the head and tail. Upon slicing the dinosaur neck and joint, you will see that fuzzy skin has been applied to the joint and socket, just like we asked it to. I'm going to print the manatee so we can see what it looks like. And there you have it. This smooth surfaced manatee now has fuzzy skin on the head and the tail. Smooth skin, fuzzy skin. Smooth tail, fuzzy tail. The introduction of the fuzzy skin painting tool 
is game changing and will allow for many visual and functional uses in 3D printing. Let me know how you plan to use it in the comments. I'm Mr. Greg. This is the Fuzzy Skin Painting Tool and you're on three. Fine. and you're on 3D Rundown.